If you want to keep your prep safe short term, this is definitely an excellent way to do it. Today, we're taking a look at the Vivor Large Double Door Security Safe Box. Let's check it out. All right, folks, welcome back. So today we're taking a look at this Vivor Large Security Safe. Um, this is more of a, I would call it a lockbox, kind of a handy way to keep things away from maybe prying eyes or prying hands. Um, I already have two full fireproof, waterproof safes. Of course, I have a huge gun safe. This is going to be more for short-term storage of something. Um, I'm leaving for the day and one of my CCWs that I don't carry, I want to put away because it's loaded. Uh, maybe I have children coming over to the house or something and I want to put my dangerous things away. Um, I, another nice thing about it, and I know that up here, is this up here, this little slot. That little slot will allow me to toss money in there. Um, one of the ways that I started saving back when years ago, when I first started saving to put, have a little bit of cash put away for emergencies, was I wouldn't spend dollar bills and five dollar bills. I'd save them all. Um, I would come home, put them in an envelope. Of course, I didn't have a safe back then, but I just put them in an envelope and hid it really well. And that worked m almost always, you know, I never had it stolen. But this is a nice way to kind of stash things quickly um, when you want to keep them away from prying eyes. Now, this is just thin metal. I mean, you know, it's not, and you can easily be broken into. Uh, if you don't bolt it down, which I plan on doing, it of course can be carried away. The locks are fairly uh, sufficient. Um, there are, you know, two bolts that come out that way. You can be pried open, of course. This is more of a secondary protection layer, okay? It is solid steel construction. It's constructed of heavy duty steel, so it's pretty decent, it's pretty heavy too. Uh, it can resist the impact of most mechanical tools. However, I'm sure with enough time, you could break into my gun safe too, or one of my other safes. It just takes time. There are two unlocking methods here. You will notice there is a digital pad here, okay? I always was nervous about those things. And they kind of made me nervous because I always thought, what happens? if my battery dies that was my first thought then of course you think about emp or what else could happen um or just the electronics fail you can still get in there there is a key the lock is hidden behind this thing here and i will show you that in a minute so you do have two ways to unlock it inside there is a red password reset button once you open the back of the door you can push that and you can set your password or reset your password if you want to do it we'll, we'll demo that to you too it does have a nice large capacity inside this is fairly big for what i'm going to be using it for it's going to be a cash type safe let me give you an, an example here i have a pretty thick stash of money here Just toss it in. That's simple. So I know that that's put away somewhere where no one's going to see it out and grab it. Could they get in there? Of course. Any safe can be broken into. Just a matter of how long it takes to break into it. It isn't fireproof and it isn't waterproof. So for short-term storage, this is awesome for me. Okay. And for those of you that have absolutely nothing, let's say you went out and bought your first handgun and you're concerned about keeping it safe. Something like this is awesome. You can stick your ammo and magazines on the bottom, your handgun on top, whatever. It is very quick access. Um, I'm going to show you how quick it is to get into it. And there you go. That simple. So you do see you have a pretty substantial lock here. And this stuff here is heavier steel than this. This is all very heavy steel in and through here. So you have a pretty substantial lockup system in there. And uh, again, to install it, all you got to do, there's holes on the bottom, down under, and there's holes on the back. And it does come with bolts. These are them. You got these bolts right here. So you can install this into concrete or the ground or a wall. It even has little grommets if you have to put this into a uh, drywall. Personally, I'd rather just find some studs and screw a couple in that way. It'd be a little bit slower to, to get it out of there. Now, it is run on four 1.5 volt AA batteries. That is behind that wall. We're going to get inside and I'll show you all the, the guts of this in a second. So you can store pretty much anything you want in here. Cash, jewelry, guns, documents, other valuables. Again, you know, if you have something better and you want to store, say, important paperwork, you want to put that in a fireproof safe. If you don't, this is a good start. And the price on it is pretty darn good, too. If you register for the site where it's located, it'll be $155.99. If you don't, it's $169.99. And if you use my promo code, which will be down below, that's VV promo, 
that you get 5% off the whole site site wide. So I will put the link for it down below and you can check it all out. So you do have a simple, easy way to program it. You can program it anytime you want. Um, we're going to get you up a little closer so I can show you the red button. It's on the other side there. And uh, let's take a look inside and see what so it's all about. let's take a quick look inside here. This is the inside here. You're going to push this red button up here. I don't know if you can see it. It's really hard to kind of see in there. I'm going to move this camera back and close the door. Okay. And then you're going to program in your code. And you can do it from four to eight characters. And you're going to hit the number button. It will beep. It'll close up. And you're ready to go. Really, really simple to program. And that's it okay now to unlock it and i do have a temporary code in here but it start the the unlock code when you get it, it's going to be one two three four that simple hit the button and it's open the bottom let's take a look at the bottom here i'm going to back the camera up a little bit and we'll take a look at now the bottom. the bottom on this i have opened it same red button on the back okay same programming if you want to get to the batteries on either one of these this is kind of tough to, to pop this off there we go. Okay. There are your batteries right in here. Okay. It's just at a weird angle from where I'm sitting. Does it pop it open? You're going to put this back on over that and slide it, snap it into place. That's simple. See, I have my one of my handguns down here just placed in there safely. Um, the carpet is kind of thin. I'd probably replace it with something a little bit thicker. Um, I probably would maybe stick my change jar in here. Um, you know, when I come home, I can throw my change in it and I know it's safe. Like I said, if I'm going to be dropping money in here at night maybe i'd put it up uh, up top there in the top part of the safe uh, up top there we go up in here in the drop section that's very handy and let me show you the neat feature of this i'm going to take off this little piece here and show you that the keys fit right in there if your electronic safe fails so hidden behind this little piece of plastic which pops out fairly easy in your hands i guess if you had a hard time you could stick a small screwdriver under there it just pops right out is the lock Comes with four keys. Of course, I've lost the other two. There we go. <laughs> Comes with four keys. They're all the same. And they will go in there and open it up. And you can get at things. So it is nice to have that just in case something happens with the lock. Maybe the lock fails. Uh, we, we, we talked about EMP a couple weeks ago. Whatever happens, you can still get at your stuff. And that is probably what sold me the most on this. Is Not only does it have a combo lock, but it also has that lock, which I can just... Close up like that and relock again, and it's locked up safe and sound. So, all in all, I like this safe as a security kind of measure, as a backup kind of measure. Like I said, if you don't have anything else and this is all you got, it's a better start than absolutely nothing. Um, I know a lot of people that will go out and buy their first handgun or whatever and they'll just stick it somewhere in the closet, you know. And, you know, as a community of gun owners, I think we should keep our guns put away and safe. So definitely a handy thing for that. So let's back up and I'm going to give you the dimensions on it and give you some final information on it and my final thoughts on it and where you can pick it up. All right. So like we said, this runs on uh, the AA 1.4, 1.5 volt batteries. You will need eight of them. It's four per. Again, if the batteries fail, you have your emergency backup lock there. The timeout period on this is four incorrect combination attempts. So after that, it will time you out for, I think it's three minutes. Next time it's 10 minutes. So if you do it twice, it'll screw you up for a little while. So don't freak out again you always have a way to in way in from there and i like the fact that it's kind of hidden too because you know like you're not always dealing with the most intelligent people that are trying to rip you off you know they'll push the buttons a few times and be like oh the hell with it you know or they'll try to break it open and that takes more time and what we want is more time while they're screwing around in there for the alarm system to call the cops and the cops to show up and that way it works a little better for you so your external dimensions are 13.8 inches by 13.8 inches by 29.5 inches. The top inside is 9.35 inches by 13.5 inches by 11.25 inches. Your bottom dimension is 19 by 13 by 11 inches. Capacity is 2.6 cubic feet. That's uh, almost one foot on top and 1.7 on the bottom. The gross weight on this is 40 pounds. So yes, you do want to bolt this down because yes, it could be carried away very easily. If you're going to put tons of ammo in there or heavy stuff on the bottom, might be a little bit harder, but still, this can be carried away. You can put it on a dolly and roll it out. So this is definitely something you want to bolt to a a wall a wall joint, a, you know, a, a stud or into the concrete somewhere where it's not going to get carried away. If say you're using this as a nightstand, 
and you only keep anything in here while you're sleeping and for quick access, say a protection device, um, this is definitely maybe not needing to be bolted down because there's nothing valuable in it during the day. But it would be a whole lot of waste for all this space just to hold maybe a handgun or something like that on the top. So I would suggest bolting it down and getting it safe. Like I said, if you register on Vivor's site, you're going to get this for $159.99. You can still use the 5% off promo, which is VV promo, and that's good for anything on the website. So if you buy this and you see something else you want, you can still use that promo discount. Okay, The link for this will be down below. You can check it out. And I am so far pretty impressed with this. This is going to go in my storeroom. My storeroom door locks. It has an alarm on it. My house is locked and alarmed. So, you know, having this inside my storeroom behind a lock, locked up and bolted, I'm not too worried about it getting uh, getting messed with. So it is a nice way to maybe, you know, if I'm not carrying a particular protection device to keep it maybe down here and to keep tossing my money in there you know when i'm saving money and it kind of keeps it away from your own eyes so you don't spend it too so it is kind of an efficient spending a uh, savings method anyway folks don't forget to check all our links this link will be down below like i said below that's our amazon affiliate store even if there's nothing in the store that you like um i put most of the stuff i do in this store if there's nothing in the store you like just click the link and shop as you normally would we really do appreciate that below that is our freeze-dried wholesaler link that link will save you 15 percent just by clicking it no codes needed you click that link you order what you want when you get to your final shopping cart checkout you will see my discount for 15 percent iridium 242 i believe or whatever it is or iridium 24 i'm not sure what it is but the link will automatically give you the discount no need to worry about that then we have our my patriot supply link that's prepare with iridium.com prepare with iridium.com we have two week four week and three month kits on there the three month kit is 200 dollars off with an additional $200 worth of survival gear. So it's not just food, you're getting survival gear too. Radios, water filters, everything. Definitely check that out. And our Thrive Life freeze-dried food store down below as well. Thank you guys for watching. Stay safe and stay prepared.